The Ohio Senate Finance Committee is looking to help local governments financially impacted by the coronavirus with federal dollars earmarked just for that reason. So the state got about $4.5 billion from the Federal CARES Act. Of that $4.5 billion, $2 billion was set aside for local government funding. However, the federal government put a lot of stringent safeguards on that. Under guidelines set by the U.S. Treasury, those dollars are specifically to help local governments with expenses related to the pandemic. Some of the gray areas, and that's why we're concerned that if we spend the money and the feds make us pay, pay it back, it could really hurt the state down the road. Of the $2 billion, $800 million is going directly to six jurisdictions with populations surpassing 500,000 people. What's left, about $1.2 billion, will be distributed by the state to less populated areas. Each county is going to get money, and it's based on the 2019 uh, local government funds that they had received before. So the money will go to the counties and then distributed to the localities from there. Senator Sean O'Brien co-sponsored Senate Bill 310, which passed yesterday. It pays out the first $350 million of the $1.2 billion. The remaining amount we're putting on a hold at this time, and we're working with our federal delegation trying to get the federal government to reduce or take off those restrictions so that we can use the money for a less gray area of dealing with the coronavirus. In Warren, Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.